Hi, this morning I'm going to be reading From Animals Nobody Loves, one of my favorite books and that kids love very much. When I wrote this book, I was interested in introducing animals to children that they really didn't like the sound of and that they had, may have read or heard something bad about. So let me read a little bit from the back of the book to begin with. Some animals nobody loves don't deserve their bad reputations. But other beasts, like 25-foot-long man-eating crocodiles and piranhas with razor-sharp teeth, are frighteningly fierce survivors. From the downright savage to the surprisingly shy, Seymour Simon, that's me, unveils the fascinating truths about 20 of nature's most underappreciated animals. Let me now read from the introduction to the book. And before I read from the introduction, let me show you a picture at the very front of the book. And this picture shows a piranha with its sharp teeth. In the introduction to the book, The animal that is shown is a vulture. And here's what the introduction says. Did you know that one blow of a grizzly bear can crush the skull of an elk? That a small fish called a piranha can be more dangerous than a shark? This book is about animals that few people like and nobody loves. Some of these animals are dangerous. Some are pests. Still others may seem strange because of their appearance. Many of the animals in this book have had stories told about them or books written about them. But it's likely that not everything you've heard or read about these animals is true. Some animals just have bad reputations that are not based on fact. Animals are not bad or evil. They do what they must in order to, su to survive. You may never love a rattlesnake, a cockroach, or an octopus, but this book may help you to understand and respect them for what they are.